Who are you expecting, Ghost Cub? Morning. Greetings from Gettysburg, Pennsylvania. Welcome back to the garage. Cup of mud in hand in the BRTV mug. If you're not familiar with BRTV and or the Briar Report, you are missing out. For sure. So, welcome back to Find Five on Friday. Are we level? Yeah. Kind of look cockeyed there for a minute. Sorry. <clears throat> so, welcome back to Find Five on Friday. I needed a much due break. Um, and I'll be honest with you, I was kind of really enjoying just being a, a uh, viewer, just watching Yinz's videos and commenting and stuff like that. And it was just nice to be able to do that and not have the constant pressure of having to hurry up and put one together and finding people that I haven't done yet and trying to find all the new people. And it, you know, just gets to be a bit much. So any words? Today, we are going to be having a bowl of McClellan's Deep Hollow. Fantastic blend. This blend is, this tin is from 06. So it's got a little bit of age on it. So it does, just a little bit. And I will be smoking it in my Bethlehem Olive Wood made by Olive Wood Piper with my beautiful purple stem in which you know is my favorite. So there she is. It is just really darkening up very nicely. So it is. It does need more love and I'm hoping to do that this winter. So um, I really enjoyed a lot of cigars this summer into the fall here and um, I'm looking to get back towards pipes a little bit more in the winter time. Especially because of being cool outside, cold here in Pennsylvania. The garage isn't heated. It's not even really insulated real well. So, you know, it could be a, a, a task. <laughs> so. Mm. Excellent. Get her going here. All right. So, um, Macy's been doing well. She, uh, is getting around a lot better now. We still can't board her or have her play with other dogs and stuff yet. So no daycare, none of that stuff yet. Um, we are hoping to start doing that soon, but the doctor said it may not be until January or February of next year. So it takes a long time for it to heal. Not that she's not healing up or healed up, but for the bone to completely take to the implant of her knee, it, it's going to take time. So, so that's where that is at. Uh, in case, you know, all of you guys that have asked through Instagram and Facebook, I appreciate it. As I just had a huge almost blowout. <laughs> So that is that. I think we're all up to date. <laughs> mm. 
Mrs. Cobb is doing <coughs> very well. Ooh, that foot smoke's potent. So we'll just get right into it. Number one for this week's Fine Five on Friday is Killer Briar 626. Killer Briar 626 is number one. Number two this week is B Dog Piper. B Dog Piper is number two. Number three is Average Mike Pipe Smoker. Average Mike Pipe Smoker is number three. Number four is Glum Chum Piper. In case you guys don't know that yet, that is Grumungeon Piper's son. So, um, man, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> and number five, the veteran of the week is none other than the big old cuddly teddy bear himself, Grumungeon Piper. He is our veteran of the week. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Thank you so much for tuning back in. I appreciate you. And um, thank you so very much for everything, all the love and the support over the years. The new and old subscribers, thank you so very much. I appreciate you. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please slide over, hit the subscribe button. Below it, hit that little arrow. It'll drop you into the root cellar. And that's where all the names and links right to their pages will be. So you, it makes it really easy for you. I really appreciate it, and uh, until we can get together and pack a pipe or smoke a great cigar, let all that you do be done in love. Y'all take care, and God bless.